and they've had some anomalous features. Fun. I love it. Uh, the first of these, uh, Muamua, discovered with telescopes in Hawaii. So that, as it came through the solar system, we said, all right, we know what trajectory an object with that speed and that direction coming in should take as it rounds the sun. Then there was the actual trajectory, which was different. Like, whoa, whoa. Well, comets have a way of outgassing when they get near the sun, and that puts an extra little sort of force on their arc of motion that has them move in ways that are not purely gravitational. And that's true for all comets. So we said, maybe it's outgassing. But suppose you look and there's no outgassing. So what's going on? Well, that's fun. So why did an object from another star system refuse to follow the path gravity predicted? In basic physics, once you know an object's position, speed, and the gravity acting on it, its route through space is fixed. That route is called its trajectory. When astronomers tracked this interstellar visitor, they found that after it swung past the sun, it was drifting away ever so slightly faster than gravity alone would allow. That extra nudge is what we call a non-gravitational acceleration, a change.